Darren Johnson, many congratulations. How did it feel to that over the line in that one? Uh, relief, <laughs> just absolute relief. Two sets to nil down and to come back and win three sets to two. Going into a tiebreaker, absolute relief, but I'm really happy. Everyone wants to know what you said to yourself at 2-0 down when you come off for the break. I was just saying to myself, you know, just keep going. I thought, I don't, I've not looked at the stats, but I thought, well, he's playing really well here. And I'm just, if he keeps it up, fair play. But stick on him and, and hope he misses. And, you know, he did. <laughs> And 2 0 lead was to Larry Butler in sets. However, in that final set, you then had the 2 0 lead. What's going through your mind at that? Do you think it's job done? I did think it's job done, and that was an absolutely stupid mistake. 2 0 up, I thought that's job done. And then all of a sudden, it's 2 all. I think I even went 3 2 down. But, and then it's refocus, hanging the <laughs> get stuck in. And. That red and black shirt, I think it brought me a bit of um, luck. Yeah, alluded to the shirt there. You've switched to your shirt for the interview, however, on the stage wearing Dennis Priest's Just can you tell us the story behind that? Yeah, well, I said to Dennis, I said, if I qualify for the World Seniors, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to wear your shirt because, for me, Dennis has been like a dad to me. Started me off in darts, travelled all over the world with him, and... I wish you were here playing, but you know, he's knocking on a bit now, to be fair. And I just think, let's not retire that shirt just yet. Let me stick it on and, you know, keep the, keep the red and black flag flying. And you mentioned their set and round coming up. Before we move on to your opponents, you've mentioned the shirt. Will that then be continued to be war throughout the weekend now you've got the win under the belt? You know, so I was talking to my mates this morning and they said, <laughs> what are you going to do if you win? I said, I'm just going to go back to this shirt. They said, oh, you can't do that. Superstition and all that. And I said, right then. I said, if I win, I'm sticking with the red and black. So it's returning for Saturday? It is returning on Saturday, yeah. On Saturday, your opponents are yet to be decided. We'll find them out tomorrow night. But the potential there for a day, but then Phil the Power Tyler. Thoughts on that? It would be awesome to play Phil Taylor, but I said it in the interview on stage, and I've said it many times, Colin McGarry is an absolutely fantastic player. I don't know how Phil Taylor's playing. I don't know if he's been practising. That's an absolute unknown. But what I do know is Colin McGarry is an absolutely brilliant player, so I'm going to prepare myself to play Colin McGarry on Saturday. And this year you've had an increase in the tournament to 32 players. We've saw 25% of the players in this tournament through qualifiers. How important do you think that is for the longevity of the seniors? Yeah, well, for the seniors tour, it's, it's absolutely paramount because if the, if the guys on the tour don't get the places, they'll drift away. So I think we need more from the tour and the, the standard on the tour is amazing. Absolutely unbelievable standard. Really good. It's as good as it. away from PDC Pro Tour, the standard in the you know in the seniors tour is as good as any, good as anything. So you know we we need more players from the tour into this. And today you had an awful lot of support in the crowd, a lot for Larry as well. But it was very loud, especially towards the end when he was taking out some of them check outs. You got more support coming on Saturday. Well, there's a, there's a load of, I've got a load of messages on my phone, a load of guys from Yorkshire coming down, but to be fair, I thought Larry Butler had more support than me in there. It, it was very back and forth from the support, but very loud and very good to hear from Sir Stavon. Just to mention on the venue, playing at the Sir Stavon, did that play a part early on in your day, do you think, playing at this iconic venue? It's an absolutely brilliant venue, I absolutely love it, superb. Well, I mean, what a venue, yeah. It's got history as well, so... And the way they've set it up, absolutely great. You mentioned your set around apart, opponents, potentially Madari or Phil Taylor. Who would you prefer to play in the set around? I don't really care. They're as good as each other, so, you know, it's all about me. If I can get my game together, I'm a, I'm a match for anybody in the world when I get my game together. <laughs> We've not seen it yet. If I can... 
if I can get into my stride, get into my game on that stage, everybody who knows me know I can really bang the high averages. So, I don't care what play. Big congratulations on your win today and good luck the rest of the weekend. Yeah, thanks very much. Thank you.